Hi everybody, it's Mr. Mo from the Southside Boys and Girls Club. And um, right now I'm trying to teach you guys a strategy in chess on how to put a white king into checkmate. So, so far, this white king is in check. See that? You see that? Because this rook can take the king. So, you want to get it in checkmate where this white king can't move anymore. So technically this white king can move back here. And it's free to move, and it's going to keep on moving back until it's in checkmate. So that's why you put this one right here, this work right here. I'm going to put it in check again. So that means it's going to be able to take it. But he can move again. So you can do bam, bam, keep on going. It's called the rolling rook. And it's called the rolling rook because it looks like it's tumbling like a barrel. Check. He can't move down here because he's going to be in check if he moves down here. He can only move backwards. And then down. And then down. Checkmate. Okay, you can't move. Now, you're probably thinking, Mr. Mo, what if you move right here? You can, put, you can take him like that. Next move. Well, that's also true. In that instance, you can just keep make sure that you have your king following, so that if you can't, so that if he, if you do, so if you do do it like that, you can go a little something like this, real quick. These are rooks. King. Opposing team. So, this is the rolling rook strategy part two. So, in the last video, it ended like, bam, 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 and then you're just like, oh my gosh, Mr. Mo, you can take him like that, and then, well, in that instance, let's go back all the way from the beginning. In that instance, you are going to just keep following up with your king. So, it's going to look something like this, because he's in check, right? Check. going to go like that. 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 It's always have to be a space between the kings. Gonna go like that. Gonna go like that. Gonna go like that. He's in check. I keep on playing him in check. I'm gonna go like this. Uh, you can go backwards because he can't go anywhere else. I'm gonna move this one forward. It looks like a barrel because rolling. That's why it's called the rolling rook. So you're going to follow up with the king. Keep on going. Wait, I was right here. I'm going to follow up with the king. No, I was right there. Okay, follow up with the king. Uh, keep going. Do it like that. King, right there. He can't take him because there has to be a space between the kings, right? There's space, there's space. Okay, all the way. Bam. Check, right? So you can take him. He's going to go right here. Because he can't go right here. Because he'll be in check. He's going to go right there. Right? We're going to go again right here. Bring it up one more. Bring it up one more. And then he's going to probably move right here. Because that's, that's the only way that he can move. Can't move right here. Cause he'd be in check. Can't go right here. Cause he'd be in check. Cause he can't move. He can't. There has to be a space between the kings. Can't go right there. Has to be a space right there. And then that's how you beat him. Ch checkmate. He can't move anywhere. If he moves right here, he can be still. T he can still get killed. Bam. If he moves right here, he can be t killed. Bam. If he moves right here, he can be killed. Bam. Moves right here. Killed. Bam. He can't move, so he's in checkmate. 